Hello everybody, I'm Dr. Mauricio Soto again from the World Best Composite Vinyl Class. After a long time, I'm here again for talk to you about our seven step and final steps in, in the way to do the best composite veneers. We're going to talk to you today about the steps of finishing and polishing, okay? We go to, I have a nice video for you, pay attention. Okay, I start the finishing, removing the excess of composite from the from and from the edge of the teeth for adjust the size and the shape of the teeth to obtain a nice smile, okay? This is a shuffle super snap black disc. Do this with care. The first step in the finishing is adjust the size of the veneers, okay? Adjust the, the size of the veneers with the face and with the smile. We remove composite until we have a perfect size for the smile. A perfect size that look good in the face. Remember, the people want smiles, not veneers. After find the right size for the veneers, I like to remove excess of composite veneer to the gum. Okay. Remember the adaptation of the composite near to the gum shall be perfect. Okay. It's important, don't let any excess of composite around the gum because this promotes the formation of inflammation in the gums. Promote the gingivitis, okay? Avoid excess of composite near to the gum. I use a very, very sharp, a very, very thin, high-speed conic board for do, for do this, okay? I use a very, very thin, high speed bore to remove the excess of composite around the gum. Remember that the composite near to the gum should be very, very thin to avoid the develop of inflammation of the gums. After the finishing, I have the right size and the right shape, okay? But I need to polish and obtain the shine, okay? I start with a pink wheel, the pink wheel of the F diacom system, and I pass this wheel in all the surface. This is the F diacom pink wheel. It's a abrasive wheel. With this wheel, you can remove some excess of composite, and you can do a pre-polishing, a preparation of the surface of the composite to the shine to for obtain shine. But with this wheel, you don't obtain shine. It's a pre-polishing wheel. Okay, after the pink wheel, I use the white, the white wheel of the diacom system for obtaining the shine of the veneers, okay? It's important, remember that the natural teeth are shining, have high shine, and you obtain this with the white polishing wheel, okay? Remember, more time, more shine, spend time, 10 minutes, 15 minutes, in shine the surface or your veneers. Now I start to use the white wheel of the if diacom system to obtain shine, okay? First I use the pink, but I finish 
I obtain the shine with the white wheel you can use with water or without water spend time 10 or 15 minutes to obtain a good shine and finally it's important polish between the teeth for polish between the teeth I use the Epitex a finishing a strip okay it's important to finish to polish very well between the teeth in this way the people the patient can pass the flush between the teeth and clean in a good way it's important to pass a finishing strip in this situation I use the Epitex finishing strip it's important to polish between the teeth and the patient can use the flush correctly now if you follow my rules my seven steps now you have a perfect veneers a nice veneers a nice smiles this is the most important thing nice smiles okay if you want to take my class you can come here to my clinic in Colombia and we together do uh, the world best class with okay this is the final result of our veneers thank you for for following me thank you for your likes and for your subscription to my channel See you in the next video. Bueno, acá está nuestra nueva sonrisa después de solo un día de trabajo. ¿Estás contenta? Mucho. <laughs> Te quedó una sonrisa muy hermosa. Sí. Felicitaciones. Que disfrutes tu linda sonrisa. Gracias. ¿Quedó contenta? Bastante. Ah, bueno. Quedó muy bonita. Felicitaciones.